Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Fanatic News. I'm Joe Boric, and this is going to be the quick Royal Take Stars of the Beginning of the Season podcast. I apologize for the mixed pronunciation of the Trois Rivieres line. Uh, listening to our great radio broadcast in Dillon, I was able to realize that's how you actually pronounce it and the way that that works there. So I mispronounced that in the first video. I apologize for that. But as for our stars, I would say if you have to give it to the goaltending early, he had a bad game against the main Mariners, did Pat Nagel. But other than that, I don't think he's expected to play back-to-back -back games. He, of course, had to come in for Kirill early in the season to be able to spot him there against Norfolk and stepped up big and stepped up big in the first set against Anirondack. I don't think he expected to play back-to-backs this early in the season. And also, obviously, Kirill's only played one game, and then Hayden Hawkey hasn't played at all. So you have to give that to Pat Nagel. The defense they don't have the sexiest numbers on paper if you look at the overall stat, but Mike Crocock has been playing a nice clean game for a Reading Royal, a nice just good overall in all facets and all zones of the game, as well as Dominic Cormier, so I would say it kind of goes into one of those guys. I really like how they played. I have to give it to Crocock, though, because Crocock's been in the four games, and he's played good in all of them in my eyes. When it comes to the forward, that one line is the stars of the forward. You got Matthew Strome with three goals, four assists for seven points. You got Patrick Baca with four goals, one assist for five points. Joshua Winquist, what reverse of that, one goal, four assists for five points. So those would be the stars of the forward core. And then when you mix them in, a guy that just does everything right, a, a guy that just does everything right and plays the game in the right way is Braden Lowe with, and also Thomas Ebbing, who was able to get an assist this evening on the first goal of Cam Strong. His career with the Reading Royals in his first professional game, his first professional goal. So that is obviously great to see for Cam Strong. So we'll throw him, since that is for tonight's game, we'll even throw him into the star of the week because of that, because he came into his first game and was able to get his first goal. So Pat Nagel in goal, stepping up, filling in for Kirill Ustamenko and stepping up against Anna Ronda gets the star of the week in net. The line of Strom, Bashkoff, and Winquist gets the stars of really the start of the season, not just the week. The start of the season at forward. And then we have, when it comes to defense, I would give it to Crocock just because he's played a good, consistent, clean game in all facets early on this season. So those would be our Reading Royal stars at the beginning of the season to start this season thus far. And then you all know at forward how much I like Lowe just for playing a clean game, as well as Ebbing and Cam Strong. Hell of a start to his career, so we are also put him in there for getting a goal in his first game with the Reading Royal. So this has been the Royal Take, the stars at the beginning of the season show. Hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, subscribe up above on the Easy to Use widget or down below if you enjoy the content. Let's go Royals. We're up 2 nothing right now against the Trois Rivieres. Sorry for mispronouncing that name in the first video. Lions, let's keep it going and beat those Lions and show them who the real kings of the jungle are, our Royal Lions. Peace out, everybody.